it is a two-part piece. First, you have to work with the community and extend hands to get more allies. Secondly, you have to stand behind the anti-discrimination law and put parts in place that will state that you have penalties and you have to adhere to the changes. Unfortunately, there isn't anything that they can do to avoid discrimination because gender expression and identity and sexual orientation is part of his law. You're born that way. So, there is nothing to avoid. It is a change of thought in how you perceive what is happening. It has brought a positive, a more positive light to the LGBTI community with the president recently stating that he supported gay marriage on top of the past three years that he has given support with the repeal of Don't Ask, Don't Tell in the military. It has changed the thought of many to respect the differences. How do I see the anti-discrimination um, issues in Colombia and how, and how do I see they should go forward first? Number one, I think that we should go forward in a movement perspective. That means to extend allies immediately, meaning more outreach into relationships with people that are not like us. Number two, fight through the Congress to add parts of the anti-discrimination law that will make sure that we are actually respected in the courts.